<laughs> oh, what a way to start off the video. Things are gonna get zesty. Hi friends, it's Heather. Welcome to or back to my channel. So today we are in my car and it is a very special day. First of all, I'm filming a video again. Oh, wow. We're also gonna, some tea is going to be spilled in this video. By the end of this video, I feel you guys will know me a lot better, whether that's good or a bad thing. Um, <laughs> and lastly, we have a very special stop today. I have been getting so many questions and comments about this. Today, we're gonna find Starbucks boy. <laughs> so, for those of you who don't know, back in the summertime, I went to Starbucks. And, uh, well, I saw a beautiful man. The boy who gave me the frappuccino was really cute. Have I seen him again? No. But I have a special feeling in my heart today that we are gonna see him again. Okay, anyway, so, yeah. Today we're gonna be driving around town, listening to music, answering assumptions, and finding the beautiful man that works at Starbucks. So let's get crack a -lockin'. <laughs> Santa baby. <laughs> should say is when I did first hear about it I heard about it while they were still on the trip and when I was told about what happened I like my heart sank Whew. it's so strange too because it was such a big part of my childhood it took up all of my time basically from the ages of 12 to 17 the channels were such a good time and now I feel like they have such a negative connotation behind them and it just ended so abruptly and no one really said what happened legally I don't know how much I can say I don't really know how like it's just it's not a good situation because it's still kind of going on now but fun fact um, there's a BuzzFeed article that came out about every like a lot of the things that happen I was actually one of the girls who was interviewed in the article so um yeah if you read that some of it might be me but it's anonymous so you don't know what is me yeet that's the tea sis that is the freaking tea oh my god the next assumption is that I got my period when I was 13 no I definitely did not I actually did not get my period until I was 18 years old aka like how old I am now. You were a horse girl. And actually, no, I wasn't. But I love that you assumed that about me. That made me really happy. Okay, so we're parked in the Boston Pizza parking lot. Let's take a look at other things that we got. You curse. Yeah, I do. I, I do curse um, sometimes. Uh, but yeah, not in a bad way. In like loving ways, I never say it in a hateful way. You were a cringy choir kid that thought they were good at singing. Um, <laughs> I was in choir in fifth grade. Um, but come on, day tanting of sauce. As we played the Linus dolls. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's nice to know so far. Thanks, bye. They actually did think I was good at singing, but I think I learned pretty quick that that is not my cup of tea. You dropped out of college. No, I did not drop out of college. I'm still very much in school mode, which is why I haven't been uploading so much. You regret being on spa. Um, no, I don't. It was a really fun time while I was on it. Everything has its ups and downs. Um, yeah, so there were some things I did not like about being on the channel. Uh, there's a lot of like a sense of competition in some ways. Um, we'd be ranked in terms of how many views you'd get, but then the rankings wouldn't work when being transferred to other channels. They wouldn't apply. There'd be very specific um, requirements you'd have to meet. I'm just gonna spill some tea. Basically, some of the requirements was that you had to look really young. And since I am a tall person, that was a big thing that was holding me back from opportunities because of my height, something I could not control. Oh, that felt so good to say. 
but yeah other than that it was great <laughs> those were just some things that are not good but for the most part the opportunities that came from it were incredible and being able to have you guys was incredible is incredible you haven't been to a wild college party yet I've been to a few not gonna lie it's been kind of good you were quiet in high school um I was a mixture of both I would be fine if I was chilling on my own but also when I'm with friends I would be wild and so get you a girl who can do both <laughs> you are very rich ha 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 I do have some money saved up from doing YouTube but that is going to my future so I would not con consider myself rich. You think you have changed a lot in the past year. I think I've changed a lot in the past six months when I've moved away. I've learned so much. So yeah, I kind of low-key have, but I'm still my same cringy, goofy girl. <laughs> that was the worst and someone just saw that. <laughs> you smoke jewel. I have tried it once, but is it my cup of tea? No. You talk to yourself. I mean, technically that's what I'm doing right now. So yes are hard on yourself yeah I assume you are the same cringy person out of camera yeah what you see here on camera is the same in real life whether that's a good or a bad thing you can decide you are high in every video no I'm not does it seem that way I don't even know how no you hated a lot of the SSG girls. No, I, I wish I had some tea to spill and be like, oh, they were snakes, but no, they're all great girls. I miss them a lot. I miss their pretty little faces. Oh, they're really great people. They honestly are really great people. I assume that your name is Heather. Oh my gosh. How, you know me so well. What is your signature dance move? This is not an assumption, but I think everyone has to see it, including the people in this parking lot, for better or for worse. What YOLO swim? <laughs> so, so many comments. About half of my things were if I have a boyfriend. You or saying that I have a boyfriend or a secret boyfriend or something like that. And honestly, I wish I could tell you what, I mean, let's go find him right now. <laughs> Starbucks boy. No, I do not have a boyfriend. I've gone on dates, but I don't have a boyfriend at the moment. Okay, so my second battery is flashing, so we're gonna whip it over to Starbucks right now and meet my future husband. <laughs> that doesn't sound creepy. Fingers crossed, you guys. This is actually the moment of truth. I'm so. <laughs> Hi, uh, can I get a tall, very, very hibiscus refresher, please? Of course. Anything else today? I'll also have the cute guy that works here, please. Uh, no, that's everything. Sounds good. Four fifteen at the window. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, it does not sound like a man. That did not sound like a man, but let's hope for the best. Okay, guys. Hi there. Hi. Great. Thank you. Thank you very much. No! My heart is broken. They were all girls in there. I mean, hey, we love powerful woman running the Starbucks. But also, where did the cute guy go? Oh, we're not doing well. Oh no. Okay, we're gonna pull over again and uh, think about all of our life decisions that have led up to this moment. Okay, I'm actually so devastated. You're wearing socks right now. Heck yeah, I am. You don't really drink, but you've tried them before. Uh, yeah, I have. <laughs> you live in LA. No, I live in Canada. You quit social media. No, but I haven't been on it that much. You are five foot seven. Add three more inches. You're no longer friends with the sax girls. No, we are still friends. I don't talk to them every single day, but when we do talk, it's like no time has passed. You get Starbucks every day. No, almost every day and it's really bad. Was this much hair out of my ponytail the whole time? My battery's gonna die because both of them are dead. Thank you so much. But thank you so much for watching you guys. I really hope you guys and I love you guys so, so much and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.
just like that, we are home. Please give this video a thumbs up if you think I should continue to search for Starbucks Boy every time I'm back in town, if that should be a new thing. Anyway, you guys, thank you so, so much for watching this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I love you all so, so much, and I will see you guys later. Bye. Don't hit me, thank you very much. I'm just trying to get to Starbucks. Um, it's really freaking cold outside. I made that's the real tea. Um, 